we've learned in, in our Pentecost style playing at bsharptricks.com can be applied not just to fast songs, but to slow songs, not just to the key of G, but other keys as well. I'm teaching you principles and concepts that can take your play into the next level if you'll take them and really learn to implement them in everything that you play. In, in this lesson, I want to take a very simple, simple song, a really simple song, like five or six chords, and show you how that we can use concepts that we've learned and, and add a few things to it to make a really, really simple song really sound jazzy and, and really sound complex, even though there's logic behind everything we're doing. Let's take a song, uh, Lord, I Want to Love You More. And, and in your lesson plan, you have a very, very simple lead sheet written out. And if I were to play it kind of basic, beginner -y style, hang with me, it would just be... 511, basically a B flat over C. Lord, I want to love you more. And a one, okay, so you're on the F, we're in the key of F, by the way. Than I ever have before. It's a two, but it's a major chord, not a minor chord. And I'm playing the seven, G7. You're so easy to adore. And it goes to G minor seven. And then C, five. Lord, I want to love you more. And it goes back to the one, okay? And then if you're good over four, five, five, eleven, then do a turn around, okay? So again, it's a real simple song. It's, it's the five or the four over five. It's a one, it's a two. First is a major chord, then is a minor chord, then it's the five and back to the one. Real simple song, right? And so let's talk, take a very, very simple song and let's learn how we can kind of jazz it up. The first thing you can do is, is to add some more advanced chords than just playing the, the bare bones chords. So instead of playing just uh, B flat over C, a C11, use some of your tricks that you learned or your concepts you learned in the latter lessons of the series at bsharptricks.com. Replace that nine and that 11 with a 13 or a flat nine or a combination. So that kind of works. That was 11. 13, 9, or 11, 9, 13, flat 9, over C, all C, okay? And again, if you need a little refresher on that, you can go back to the series at bsharptricks.com. Go to the last couple of lessons where we talk about chord extensions and 13 chords and, and on the five combos. That, that's essentially what I'm doing. Then on the one, we can add a major seven. Let's add a major seven with that dreamy sound. And let's go ahead and add the two to make it a nine. So we're playing an F major nine. So F major seven, add the nine. And then on the G7, the two, let's go ahead and add the two to make it a nine, okay? And then on the G minor, seven, let's go ahead and add the two to make it a nine. And you're right back to C, some good little combos. And then back to, so it'll sound like this. Lord, I want to love you more. And you hear right away the fancy chords. I ever have before. Make it really, really a lot richer, even though we're still playing it simple. You're so easy to adore, okay? Lord, I want to love you more, okay? Now, the next thing you can add is to add a little groove to it. And what I mean by that is, instead of playing it beginnery, where it's the kind of the, you know, just kind of banging out the chords, add a little groove to it, little, just a little snags. Lord, I want to love you more. Basically, I'm doing one of two things. Either going bum 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 bum, or I'm going bum 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 bum, or bum 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 bum. So try either one and try to keep the whole thing, the groove throughout the whole thing. Again, let's do one. changes the character of the song right there. I'll do the other one, the one that has two bombs. Take the time to get these grooves down. With the advanced chords, 
really changes the sound of the song. Okay, so just put advanced chords and then kind of a little rhythm. All of a sudden, we got beyond beginner and we're getting to something really nice, kind of a little, little, little movement there and a little groove. Okay, take the time to get those grooves down. The other thing I was doing was occasionally instead of going, and I'm just kind of rolling the notes of the chord in between the bum bums. So you're going bum 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 bum, right? Bum bum bum, but do it like this. kind of adds a little extra. So try that. Take some time to get the groove down and then we'll try to take it even up another notch, taking a very simple song and having fun with Pentecostal style playing tricks. Mm -hmm.